I don't know where this idea, I honestly don't know where the idea of an apology started because uh, I think some, someone in the chain of press or something said something to somebody over there, not here. But let me be clear. Uh, President Karzai didn't ask for an apology. There was no discussion of an apology. Uh, there will be, there is no, I mean, it's just not even on the table. He didn't ask for it. We're not discussing it. Uh, and that is not the subject that we have been talking about. What we've been talking about are the terms of the BSA itself, uh, which provide the outline of the structure, the process by which uh, ISAF, international forces, the United States forces themselves, uh, would be engaged going forward. As, as I think you know, it is a very limited uh, uh, role. It is entirely train, equip, and assist. There is no combat role for United States forces. And the bilateral security agreement is an effort to try to clarify for Afghans and for United States military forces exactly what the rules are with respect to that ongoing relationship. It's very important for President Karzai uh, to know that uh, issues that he's raised with us for many years have been properly addressed. It's very important for us to know that issues we have raised with him for a number of years are properly addressed. The agreement will speak for itself when the agreement is approved. And as we sit here tonight, we have agreed on the language that would be submitted to Aloya Jirga, uh, but they have to pass it. Uh, 